Yeah. So the consultation we have is you're not allowed to fly the drone. I am. On, you're not on not on Milton Park without the site owner's permission. <laughs> So welcome back to the channel guys. Today we're here in Didcot, Oxfordshire, taking a look at Hatchet UK distribution. Now, Hatchet UK provide leading edge fulfillment and warehouse services to over 20 publishers, specializing in a wide range of sectors, including trade, illustrated, educational, academic, professional, schools, and children's books. Now, this public footpath, I'm not sure where it ends. That's obviously an access road to another site in the future. So their land, I would have thought, is concrete area. Oh, well, what can we see from here then? It has got an electric fence going all the way around the outside. Royal Mail have just gone in, past the gatehouse. Uh, they're heading down in that direction there, where I can see, well, what trailers are they? Don't recognize them ones. You can see woodland just there. Other than that, I can't really see many names. Lindy, got the forklift repair guys here. Do you want me to come there? Do you want me to come to you? Yeah, you I can't hear you. Yeah, yeah, you alright? I can't hear you over there. Yeah, that's fine, I know. There's a little noise around. You alright? Yeah, yeah, I'm just filming. Filming for what purpose? Uh, just to make a YouTube, uh, sorry. To make a video from a YouTube channel. Uh, about what? Hatchet. Uh, it's not what we are going to the reception and speaking to them and then taking proper permission and then doing proper pictures. I, I don't think they'll say no, but I think it's better you follow the right procedure. Oh, do you think they might let me inside? Why not? They will let you inside if what you are trying to do, if you show them a, 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 a good reason why why you are doing it, they, they, they should not have any, any issues with that. They don't I've know. never seen it before. I'm the security officer here, obviously and i'm not allowed to allow anyone to do anything on a private property except they go through the, the normal process if you go there they tell you no that you can't if, they do, if you go there they tell you yes that you can and obviously if they tell you yes they'll let me know now i like access to every, every anywhere access to go to i have no issues with that but just standing here and taking pictures and videos i'm not sure it's the proper thing to do right until you get the, until you get the proper permission right so if i get permission yeah then they might let me on site. Yeah. But if I if they say no. Yeah, then they are, they, they, then you can't do it. Then you, probably they will say no for a reason. Yeah. They'll give you a reason for saying no. One minute, please, one minute. You can go and do him, I'll wait here. Alright, cool. Yeah. So, so if they say yes, I've got no issues. If they go, if they say no, then I wouldn't be able to allow it anyway either. Yeah. Yeah, but, but I don't, I don't, I, I don't see it as a, as any bad thing. But I just want to be sure that you are doing the right thing, and I'm also doing the right thing. Right. I'm just trying to think about this because. What kind of documentary? What sort of documentary do you do? Out here. It's really nothing to do with them, is it? Yeah, but we were taking pictures like this. I was watching you. Yeah, I can take... Because I can see it from out here. Yeah, yeah, you can... Is this their land out here? Uh, I've, got no, I've, no, I've got no idea. You didn't come into the premise, yeah. as far as I'm concerned. You didn't go into the barrier, as yeah. far as I'm concerned. But taking pictures, I'm like... I'm not, I'm, I mean, I'm not stopping from taking any pictures. But I'm, what if they say no, would you stop me then? Yeah, but obviously I work for them and they give me instructions on what to do and what not to do. Yeah. So if they tell me no, I wouldn't be able to let you in. But... No, I don't want to come in. I just want to do my video from out here. Uh, that might be what... But I don't even want to bother them. I don't even want to ask permission because they're not going to give me permission to go inside, are they? Come on. Yeah? Yeah, he's allowed to. I'm allowed to? Like I said, I don't know. <laughs> I didn't uh, well, stop you. I just I said no, no, said, no. You said go and check, check with them in yeah, reception. Yeah, if he's, if he's, if he's okay. okay. Or... DJ, hold it. 
Oh, you know him? Just a YouTuber, just DJ Audits on YouTube. Hey, my friend. Did you want to say your name or not? I can see you hiding your face. No, no, There's no. a key ring, all right. Well, he's allowed to. But off, off, not, not on our site, off site, he's allowed to. Yeah, as long as I stay off site, I can film the building. And then all I right. put it on YouTube and I fly a drone around as well. I get an aerial shot. This is all private here. Nah, past the barrier. No, it's not, it's not just the barrier. That's, yeah. It's still part of the private land. Well, this is the conversation that we was going to get to. You know this is a private road, right? Let me, let me talk to you mm -hmm. about private roads, right? Do you know where this road, you know where he's parked? Mm -hmm. That's going to be another building site eventually, yeah? Mm -hmm. So a different business is going to be on that. Probably it's the us. Probably. From what I heard, I, I, have, I, have no, I have no proof of that, yeah. Uh, neither do I. Right? Yeah. But because it's an access road, yeah. Hatchet can't say, you can't come down this road because they don't solely occupy the road. Do you know what I mean? Okay. So I already knew that. So I'm just standing out somewhere, which is an access road shared, filming Hatchet UK, mm -hmm. and I think that's okay. If I start going onto your site or mm -hmm. into reception, mm -hmm. I really shouldn't be filming, should I? Unless I ask permission. Yeah, but so I just, I, I'm just saying because you were standing here and you were filming here. It's different from when you were standing over there and filming here. Yeah. I mean, there's a, there's, there's a very thin line between both of them. Do you know where the tarmac starts? Yeah. I'm going to stand there and film. And anywhere on the tarmac, so your concrete is your land. Tarmac is shared. Okay. Uh, do you want me to verify that for you or you want me? It's up to you. You yeah, do your job. Because I, I, because I need to know what is right and what is not right. Because... You can do whatever you like. Yeah. Because All I'm... I've got to do uh -huh. is be honest with you mm -hmm. what I'm doing. Okay. So I'm filming Hatchet for my video, put it on YouTube okay. to make some money. Okay. All right. All right. Because you do books here. Yeah. Can you... I just verify that in front of you so that you know if it's right or not? I can, make... I can make a call. I don't mind. Even if they say no, I'm still going to do it. I mean, like, just for my own... For my own like i need to be able to let's say they say no and ask you to stop me i'm still gonna they're, do it they're not gonna ask me to stop you yeah i'm still if, whatever if happens insist to stay they're not gonna ask me to stop you yeah whatever happens i'm gonna carry on <laughs> do you know what i mean <laughs> all right, all right. Okay, i've got to make just, my money let me just do my own part in it it's a but it, by you doing your part it's not gonna stop me do you know what i mean so i'm just gonna film it's just it's just my 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 for my own piece yeah of yeah mind. yeah i'll leave it with you mate So there we have it, handled that very well. Guy approached <laughs> with his hood up, covering his face. He obviously knows the score. But over here, we was on our way over here. Looks like an access road to a plot of land, for future development. So they certainly cannot be controlling what happens over here, can they? Because anybody can buy this. So the open shutter. Can't really see anything in there. And we won't be able to read the label from this distance. I'm not going to get too close. I'm just going to stay around this uh, access road to this bit of land. Who nobody knows who's going to occupy it in the future. We can come up to this point without any trouble at all. So, apart from the little chat that we had with security there, and we gave away the little key ring, we've not managed to see much at all, have we? So out here, on the pedestrian crossing, we have got a member of staff over there, keeping their eye on us. So this little bit of tarmac that I'm standing on now, crosses over just there, drop curb. So it's all publicly accessible. Let's get David up and see what Hatchet UK distribution looks like from above. So once again, we've checked on drone assist, the only restriction, well, it's not even a restriction, it's a ground hazard, the old power station used to be all on this land here. Hatchet UK. Let's have a look at you then. So that's the site, the entrance, where I'm standing, just there. And the access road to the new development, whenever it happens, over there. Two vehicles just pulling into that little bit. Oh, one of them anyway. Doesn't look like they're stopping, so we'll carry on. So past the gatehouse gets you into the HGV yard. Where oh they're very busy, look. Look at all them trailers on the bays. 
and some of them have the numbers on the top of the trailers for the high value goods imagine a whole trailer full of books oh yes knights of old that's the haulier here that we couldn't read earlier and the pallets are very well neatly stacked aren't they oh yes there are no solar panels but hiding down at the back we have the staff car park uh, we saw there was a lot of automation here so we don't expect many but oh yes look at that quite a lot of people working here although i would say car park 50 percent but the electric fence continues look all the way around the outside perimeter it does make you wonder what's inside here but maybe the electric fence is from the old power station it's okay i'm flying the drone now Sorry? i'm flying the drone I can't hear you. i'm not shouting no worry, no worry. yes I, because it goes all the way past there i think it's the uh, the old perimeter fence for the power station oh, that would make sense over in the distance over there is the data center that we covered on a previous video and that just leaves the little access road oh my boss is actually missing that's what i was saying oh okay yeah so i'm not able to get hold of anyone so if i just keep on doing what you're doing so far as you don't get in that's fine okay as long as i don't come in you're happy yeah Pardon? as long as i don't come in you're happy yeah 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 I, I mean if you, if you need to come in then i need to ask them first i don't want to come in mate as long as I don't come in, I'm happy. <laughs> you make it hard work don't you all good. No problem, my friend. All good. Thank you. Yeah, cheers, pal. So there you are, the whole site in one shot. Let's do a 360 degree photo for Google Maps and move on. So the location of the DJ audits keyring on this video is just on that tree. Just there, look. If you are one of the first people to watch the video and you do want a keyring, well, good luck with that. And then we get to the other entrance of Hatchet UK distribution, where we've got a couple more open shutters. The first being that one there. I'm going to see anything through there. I'm okay, yeah. It's a lot busier around this entrance, doesn't it? You don't want media? No, no, I'm here, but I'm just wondering why are you taking pictures for me? Just want to know. Just about the book warehouse. Where is for me? Books. Books. Okay. Uh, do, you, no, you can you can come and uh, you can ask them if you want to visit. You don't have to take pictures, or you can take the permission from them because they might be not happy with the taking picture. Exactly. Yeah, that's it. So if you want, you can get the permission and they can. Take you around? They won't, not with photos. Nobody oh. does. Okay. They always say no. I've asked loads of times before. I want to see inside. I want to see um, the forklifts move in. And because there's a lot of automation in here, conveyor belts and stuff like that, aren't there? Uh -huh. And machines. Yeah, okay. Uh, are you, uh, so, sorry, is Brooklyn's own company or just a uh, normal? YouTube. YouTube. Are oh, you putting on uh, YouTube? Yeah. Okay, okay. I, I find this place a little bit interesting uh -huh. because you do all the books. Okay. Um, you very you well. You can ask. Uh, you can send them email. They can to take you around. They'll just say no. On your. Is it? You've worked here quite a while, yeah. yeah. Have you ever known anybody to film inside and have a tour? N not really, but. Uh, so yeah. why suggest it? I mean, no, just in that case, if you want to see, interested in something, you can see physical. But maybe they now will allow you to take a photo, but they can show you around. Right. When I do this, you yeah. know, if I say, "Is it okay if I do this, this, and this?" Yeah. and they say no. Well, I'm going to do it anyway, and it seems rude. Yeah. For the big boss has just spent all this time yeah. coming down from his meeting or his office uh -huh. to talk to me. Yeah. I've spoke to him. He said no. No. Yeah. And I've gone and done it anyway. It's quite rude. So I just stay outside. I don't yeah. get involved anymore. Yeah. But you've got loads of books in the skip, haven't you? Yeah, yeah. I'm yeah. going to zoom in. I'm going to take the drone over yeah. and have a look. <laughs> Make a nice video about the place. 
So yeah, there's quite a few bucks in that skip rut. That's there. So are they brand new? If so, why are they just being dumped? Why are they not given to charity? We have got one open shutter over there as well. Let's have a quick look inside that. Nah, it's not possible. Just empty racking in that one. So from here, I think we will get David up and have a look to see what's in that skip. Right then, what have we got? Ian Rankin. A heart full of headstones. Frankie Boyle, meantime. Two weeks to a younger you. Got all sorts in here. Yeah, I'm just flying the drone. Sorry? Just flying the drone. Over our side? Yeah. Why? <laughs> Atmospheric science. Noel Fitzpatrick. Nick Hunt. All sorts in there, isn't there? So, have you spotted a book that's familiar to you? This skip is very, very deep. I'll give you some context. Look at that. Full of brand new books. Wow. And then in this one, we have some sort of automated robots there and lots of other bits of metal. Just as you would expect in a metal skip. But the one next to it, that was just ridiculous, wasn't it? And there's another one there. I didn't notice that. Let's have a look in that one as well. So what we're going here then? Loads and loads of books. All brand new. What a shame. The Autograph Hunter by Adam Andrusia. So I think we get the gist of that. They throw away a lot, an awful lot. Here at Hatchet, UK distribution. I think I can hear something now on the radio. Yep. Because you're not no allowed problem. to fly Give me a, ring and I'll follow. I am. a drone on the park without permission from CBRE or NEPC. I am. You've had permission from. No, don't need it. Oh, you don't need permission? No. Oh, okay. It's a bus route. This is a private estate? Yeah, but it's a bus route. So members of the public get off the bus and walk. Oh, right, okay. So, roads off this main road here are privately maintained, but this one is maintained by the council. So you're allowed to dry, uh, um, use a drone? Yep. Any, any road? Route. Yeah. The bus route don't turn off this road, does it? It just continues down here. Well, 
flying a, a drone, he has been flying a drone. Um, he says he has permission um, because um, this, the park drive is a bus route um, and members of the public obviously get off buses here um, and he says he's allowed to do it. That's what I said to him, it's a private estate and he needs permission from MEPC and CBRE, but he says no, he's allowed to do it. Okay. Um, I'll, um, I'll get hold of the police then and ask the um, Okay, received. Yeah, the police will clear it up for you. When the road is maintained by the public, the public can do what, any lawful activity on that road or path. So I've got the proof that I need um, when the police arrive. Do you, do you want to see it? Um, Park Drive, Milton, Abingdon. Responsibility, mixed maintenance respon responsibility. Okay, so when you come down this road, some of the roads off it, like that one there, Olympic Avenue, that's not maintained at the public expense. But if it's mixed, then I'm afraid I contribute to this road and I can use it. That's why the bus is coming down it. Members of the public that are coming down here, getting off the bus. Can I just take a picture of it? No, you can't. I can't um, take a picture of it. All right, okay. Well, well, so can I take a picture of you? Can I, no, not you, just the picture. Yeah, but it might phone. get me in it. It might get you in it. I was just oh, that, was a, that was just a test for you to see how you respond. <laughs> no, but honestly, it's all good. I'm going to fly my drone up at loads of businesses along this road. This is just the first one today. These do books. You see that skip there? Full of brand new books. See it? Overflowing. Brand new books. Yeah. What a waste. Highlighting things of the public interest. You know, there's a lot of charities that could benefit from all those. Yeah. All right. Right. OK. <coughs> Uh, they're they're going to create some privacy. Good on them. So now it gets interesting. Now this dock here, because that's got a, a chance of falling, that really, that door to the dock should be closed when a vehicle is not on it. So things have gone quiet here at Hatchet. She stopped using the walkie talkie. <laughs> I don't know why they use the PMR frequency, the public frequency, in uh, commercial capacity, especially security, you know. They don't really want to be listened into, do they? Hiya! So we need to clear up something. Park drive. Yep. When there's a pothole or anything like that, who pays for it? For the maintenance? Your park, MEPC. You sure? Positive. I've got evidence to show that the public purse contribute. Okay. So, so why, have you got why, any evidence why, of your claim? Why are you taking... I've, I've, I have no evidence. Okay. You've obviously... You, you have evidence? Yeah, yeah. Park Drive. Mixed, have, mixed maintenance responsibility. Which, which, which evidence? Where, so where did you find your evidence? A government sir? source. Okay. Which government source? Well, I am willing to show the police it, but... They're, I, they're actually coming. Yeah, please. I know. Good. Because I want to carry on without any interference you, from your colleague. Nobody is stopping you from taking a photograph, sir. No, I was flying the drone. Okay. You can't fly the drone here without I've already done permission. It. Yeah, but you can't fly it without permission. This is what I mean. Next time I get the drone out, I don't want to have any confrontation with anybody about right. it. So the confrontation you have is you're not allowed to fly the drone. I am. On, you're not on, not on Milton Park without the site owner's permission. Now, I can give you the site owner's number, and I'm quite happy to do that. And you could contact him and say, 
can I fly the drone on Milton Park? Don't need to. You, okay, let, let me just okay. explain. You, what you say, what you're saying, what you're saying yeah. to me, what evidence you do have, you don't need. Yeah, a government need. source, which I've showed the police. I showed the police it the other day when I was in Newport doing exactly the same. Right. They claimed that it was their land. Is this recording, by the way? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's evidence. For, for evidence for what? Well, you've you've stated in an official capacity that. What, what's this place called? Milton so, Park. Sorry. I need, I need, I can need to take some advice about this. You no, know, you've already said it. Milton Park, no. maintain the road. I believe that the council do. I, I, I need, contribute. Sorry, I just need to take some advice. You should have okay. done that before you came to the window. You knew what I was here for. Sir. You've made claims, you, sir, you need to back them up. All I know is you're trying, you, you literally, I, I, you may well have legitimate claims. You may well have legitimate I'm willing to show you. I, show me that. Okay. Please. Then we can bottom it out, can't we? So, this, uh, da, 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 da. I'll just get it back up for you. Park Drive, Milton, Abingdon. The responsibility, it's a mixed maintenance responsibility for the local highway so authority. So that's on Find My Street? Yeah. Now, this is a local government source, you say, government association. Now, if you, we choose one of these other roads, Olympic Avenue, for example, it clearly says it's not maintained at the public expense, so I'm staying off those roads. That's, that's fine. But does that still give you the, the ability to buy a drone route? Yeah, and I'll put it into simple terms for you. If I pay, my taxes pay for the maintenance yeah, of this sure. road, oh, same, then same, I can same, use same it. Same as me, too. Yeah, yeah. Same exactly. as any taxes. Exactly, yeah. So we can use it to walk our dog, fly our drone, fly our kite, our I'm, remote control car. I'm not sure about drone. I'm not oh, sure yes. about drone law. It's launching, it's launching from land that we pay to maintain. That's the crucial part. Right. Launching and landing from so, the land. So where did you get that information from? Find my street. No, the, you can launch a drone from, from a privately owned property. Privately owned? Publicly owned? Pri privately. I just showed you. It's maintained by the public purse. But it's not, but it's not owned by the council. It's, it's owned by Milton Park. Yeah, but it's they a, are the okay. adopted. Adopted by the council. Any adopted council adopted road, I can fly my drone on. Right, okay. I, I, can't, I can't argue you. If you want you to fly, have. It, no. You've if told you your colleague to, to you, stop me. Please, sir. Please stop trying to get a rise. Okay. I'm going to carry on now because we're not getting that, anywhere. No, that's fine. You carry on. Thank you. I hopefully the police will come along and explain the situation to you. I'm not quite sure. I mean, we, I, I can't stop you because physically I can't. I'm not going to physically come and stop you. If it was a criminal offence, you can step in and use reasonable force. You, it's an indictable offence. You sir, can do a citizen's arrest. Sir, please. You know please. that, don't you? Can we just be sensible about this at the moment? If I was robbing an old I lady, exactly, please step in. I know exactly what you're here for. Well, allow okay. me to do a lawful activity then. Go and do your lawful activity. That's what I want. Then I will go, I will speak to the police, and they will come and make sure it's lawful. Yeah. As soon okay. as they hear that it's a drone being flown on this road, they'll know not to come. Okay, that's fine. Okay, so that's I'll, why they're probably not here already. So I'll, I'll, I'll contact them and we'll find out. You have already contacted them, haven't you? Before now, it, yeah. yeah. All right. I can't. I can't wait too long. I'll give them like another half an hour, and then that's. I've got you, to get out of here. You can have as much time as you like, sir. Because I've been waiting you, for them about twenty minutes already. Is that what you want? The if it was an urge, well? yeah. Because we need to clear up. You, the lady down there, she was adamant. Okay. Was you on the other end of the walkie-talkie giving I her instructions? Was, yeah. yeah. So you should know better. Hopefully, we can all learn from this, guys. Yeah. Sorry, sir. I'm You're not willing to learn from need, it. I need to go and speak. Take okay. care. Have a nice day. So at the moment, Oxfordshire County Council have closed this bus stop. But it just goes to show, doesn't it? That Oxfordshire County Council, in partnership, yeah? In partnership with Milton Park. So they've adopted this road. They'll run a bus service down here. They'll bring all the public down here. But when you get off the bus, you're restricted on what you're allowed to do. I don't think so, do you? As soon as I get off the bus, they don't make the rules of what I can or cannot do. Milton Park, who do they think they are? Especially on Park Drive, you know, start telling me what to do if you actually fully maintain the road. But if I'm contributing to this road, I'm going to continue doing my lawful activity on it. Thank you very much. Is it all OK? <laughs> You're ignoring me now. She's ignoring me, look. She don't want to talk to me. I just said, is it all okay? So we waited around for another half an hour, but didn't see security again. 
didn't see the police. It went really quiet. So I'm not sure what the police said to them, but they stayed away. So if you have enjoyed that video, do give it a thumbs up for me and I'll see you on the next one, guys. Bye-bye for now.